I'm Courtney Seligman, Professor of Astronomy, Long Beach City College, have been for the best part of 40 years now. And I teach astronomy lectures and labs here at the college. For the last couple of years, we've had a brand new planetarium made by Evans and Sutherland of Salt Lake City, I believe. It is, at the moment, the state of the art for small planetarium domes such as ours, although 35-foot diameter is not that small. It's one of the largest at any community college in the nation. Uh, it exhibits on the dome a virtual reality theater that can show the sky, the stars as they are now, in the past, present, or future, bright city skies, dark skies, um, basically anything that the mind of man can conceive and a graphic supercomputer can render. Although the planetarium is intended primarily as a teaching tool for the classes here, um, one of the major uses is for presentations to the general public, community outreach and the like. Anybody is welcome to come to the shows. There's no admission. We do always uh, accept donations if people want. But um, all you have to do is contact me and make a reservation or just show up outside the door on the evening of a show. The planetarium shows that I present consist of about a half an hour to 45 minute introduction during which I use the keyboard on the host computer to type in commands on the fly, live presentations of various things that regular planetariums can do and only digital planetariums can do, a few clips produced by professionals at Evans and Sutherland to show what you can do with thousands of hours of training and tens of thousands of hours of time and effort. And then towards the end, I show a 20-minute survey of the history and the structure of the universe called Wonders of the Universe. Um, then we go up to the roof and take a look through the telescopes, and as wonderful as the show is, um, the telescopes are another thing entirely. Most people have never seen the moon or anything else through a telescope. You can see photographs of it on the internet and textbooks and the like that are for, far more detailed than looking through a telescope, but there's nothing like the immediacy and sharp reality of seeing it for real. And people are always really impressed. I, I still have students that I had 38 and 39 years ago writing me about how much they enjoyed taking the course here and how much they got out of it. And I think, I'd like to think that in 38 or 39 years I'll be getting letters from my current students. Uh, and perhaps in 15 or 20 years, some of the Girl Scouts and Boy Scouts and other children who were here tonight uh, will enroll simply because they became interested in astronomy as a result of the program tonight. And that's one of my greatest hopes.